Craig Birch here at the ECC Sports and Social Club on Shoal Road in Wolverhampton where one of the BDO World Championship entrants, Scott Baker, is down here practising with the ECC sponsor, Jamie Hughes. Scott, yeah, had a good Christmas and New Year? Yeah, yeah brilliant. Really good. Well, family time. Yeah, Double family time. Break. It's practice time as well though, isn't it? Oh yeah, I've been fitting in some practice every night. Uh, good couple of nights out with Jamie. Yeah, just keeping busy with it now. Yeah, you've been a busy man this Christmas because you've been to Butlins, uh, mine and Butlins as well, haven't you? So the kids there, so yeah, as we do every year. Yes, yeah. it's, it's nice for the kids. It's a nice getaway. Yeah, I bet. I bet you wish I'd left the dart boards there though from the, from the darts tournaments. I wish, I wish I'd have took me darts with me. I forgot them. <laughs> <laughs> Goodness me. So I'll be, maybe did it do you good though to have that break for three or four yeah, days? Yeah, yeah, it's nice to have a break. Um, yeah, but as soon as as soon as you get back, it's like back to business. Yeah, yeah, and that business is the BDO World Championship 2018 starts at Lakeside from Saturday. You're in action first game on Monday night against Andy Beatons, and uh, are the nerves starting to amass yet, or not really? Uh, I'm not nervous. I'm more anxious. I'm um, just just waiting round. You know, you know you're gonna get there. You know you got to play to this to that. I just want to get there and do it now. Let's get yeah. on the stage. Yeah, it's a bit of a wait though as well, isn't it? Because um, I've mentioned. A lot of people don't know this as well, but Friday you need to be there for the players' meeting, which you don't have to be there, but you need to be there, really. But I suppose as a debutant as well, you need that time to acclimatise, maybe watch a couple of days of the games before you go on yourself. Yeah, yeah, well, that's it, yeah. Because I don't know what it's all about. What first time being there, it's nice to see what the ins and outs of it all. Of course, of course. And it, we mentioned this in the last interview, Andy Beeson's as well. That's not a, the worst draw you could have had. It would have been a lot worse if you'd have been a preliminary round. Cause oh, yeah, that I wanted to avoid the preliminaries at all costs, really. Um, well, I did, and like we said before, there's no easy draws. You, you know, you don't really want to pick anyone at this stage, at any stage. But, you know, I've got Andy, so yeah, it's either going to be his day or my day. Of course. Do you know Andy much from the tour? Yeah, I know Andy fairly well. Yeah, We've played each other a few times now, and, and we was in the... What was it called? the pentathlon together as well? Oh right, okay. Yeah, yeah. Uh, what was that like then? Oh, that was good. I mean, it was new. It was different, uh, and I thoroughly enjoyed it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So Andy's, you probably call him a friend, I guess, from the yeah, circle, yeah, yeah, yeah. So. Good friend, yeah. Have smiled, you seen? Smiled to him over Christmas. Did you? What did he say? Well, not over Christmas. Sorry, New Year's Eve. <laughs> yeah. Wait till you had a few then before. Yeah, you definitely it. had a few. <laughs> so what did he say? Oh no, it was just um, just Facebook trash, really. <laughs> Facebook trash. We like Facebook trash. Tell me what it was. Um, no, it was. I'm going to beat you and beat him. No, ideas, definitely like not. That. Nothing like that. He's, he's a nice guy too. Uh, it was just he, he put a picture on and I just said, "Was you drunk?" <laughs> and then it snowballed from there. I suppose. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, I think we're probably all best to leave So, but Andy, obviously Andy's a great guy. He's a good dog, good dog player as well. Isn't yes, he? very good dog player. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Have you played him anywhere on the tour before? Or? Romania in the final. Uh, was that was that your first final you reached, or was it? No, that was, that was this year. Uh, sorry, last January's that was my first final. But the year before, when I first started, uh, I lost to Fabio Ruse and Brandy in the same final in Romania. Yeah. And then Jamie was in the other final, and he won that one. <laughs> right, right, okay. So, when have you so you played? If you played Andy in the final, was it or did you? Come across Andy along the way in any within? Or? No, that was it. The final in Romania. I played him in Celsi. It was at the British, no, England Open or the England one of the England ones, and that was the last sixteen, I think. Right. And he just picked me, and it was a really good game, to be fair. What's the record like, Tony? What can you remember between the pair of you? Two nil to Andy. Two nil to Andy. Oh, you're <laughs> third time's a charm, is it? That, is that well, you never know. <laughs> yeah. So you. Yeah, you've not had the best luck against Andy, but that could all change, particularly in a sets environment as well. Well, that's it, yeah, we've never played a sets game before, so... Yeah, is uh, it... I mean, you have to, it, I mean, Andy's a man of the circuit and so on, it, you know, he may not be that used to sets himself. I hope not. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm sure he is. Uh, I mean, he was at the Finders, you know, he's, he's been on the big stage before. Um, I, don't, I don't know what, I, what else I can say, really. Course, he's, he's as yeah. experienced as me, I suppose. Yeah, well, you never know. You know, it's hard to know what to expect from a debutant who goes into a set scenario because they either, they can absolutely nail it as well as absolutely bombing it as well, doesn't it? So yeah. it, it's it's a bit of a banana skin for Andy, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I would say that. Yeah. Of course, of course, of course. And uh, 
going into a tournament like this. I mean, Andy's going to be the slight favourite and you're the debutant with nothing to lose. I mean, that would have been the same if you had played anyone, really, wouldn't it? Yeah, yeah, I'll take that any day, any road. It'd have been nice to break into the top 16, be a seed and that, but I'm just happy to be there. Yeah, I mean, you were ranked 20, 24th? 23rd. 23rd by the end of it, so you, you're knocking on the, you're starting to knock on those doors, aren't you? Yeah, I've, I've been oh, I've been high all season, and then the last two comps of the season, like Bridlington and Celsius, I've dropped a lot of points. Um, which I, I thought to myself, you know, I could do about this. Well, it still landed me a place in the first round, so I was more than happy with that. Of course, of course. Did you know you was going to be in the first round before those last two comps? Was it? I really don't. I don't think that far ahead. It's only what other people have said. Like, oh, you're safe. You know, I tend not to bother with any of that. Yeah. Cloud your mind. To, you know, just get away from it all. Of course, of course. And you're on the other half of the side to the guy you're down here practicing with tonight, Jamie Hughes. <laughs> So you two guys can only meet in the final. We've established after a lot of a lot of pondering between all three of us. But, so uh, yeah. So but you you can only meet him in the final, and uh, yeah. we, it's an interesting one, isn't it? It, it is so, interesting. It's, it's good um, because I wouldn't want to meet him in the first round. Obviously, it'd be better if we did meet in the final. But then on the other hand, for the people back home, we want to see that sort of match, and you know, a first round. That cloud, or oh, I, I don't know. It's, it's one of them. I'm not. Yeah, you could have, you could have, you could have met each other in the first round. Yeah. In all fairness, as well, and that would have been very, very interesting, wouldn't it? So, yeah. but I think Jamie said straight off, I could, I could have done without that in the first round. <laughs> so, but it's all interesting stuff as well. I mean, do, do you look at your route through? Do you look at what you'd have to do to sort of get further on in the tournament? We're glad your athletes come along the way. From, from what I've heard, yeah, but um, I really don't pay that much attention. I take one game at a time if I win. Fair enough. Look at the next one then. Yeah, Jamie had pretty much the same sort of attitude. You know, he's looking at his first opponent and no further, and that's the way he works. He doesn't look at draws or anything like that. You say sort of, say sort of player. I think that's the best way to go about it. I mean, if you look too far ahead, you, you're underestimating your opponents and then disrespecting them. I I, I don't know, but you should you should just look at each game as it comes. Really focus on that one first. Yeah, of course, of course, and obviously, I mean. The PDC World Championship just passed. Lakeside starts on Saturday. Talk about uh, I think if you actually thought about it, something will happen in the PDC tournament this year. The more it's better happen in the BDO tournament. I mean, Rob Cross has been such a breath of fresh air to everyone, and such a big surprise to the whole world of darts. Never mind any code. Oh, mate, he's fantastic for what he's done. Um, was it twelve months? Just over twelve. Yeah, months? didn't even have a tour card this time. He's, uh, that is inspirational for any darter. I mean. From what pub darts to world champion? Yeah, call not the bluff, fair play. Beating Van Gogh and t- <laughs> <laughs> beating Van Gogh and a, a Taylor on the way, really. Isn't oh it? yeah, fantastic games and uh, well deserved to come through that field and and do the business. Man, that's off to you. Yeah, yeah. Well, there's nothing one more you can say, but does it get? I think uh, it gives everybody, you know, debutants like yourself, even the guys in the preliminary round of the BDO, and anybody who go, you know, the lads in here. You know, chucking darts, just practicing as long as everybody that sort of that sort of impetus that it can be done, can't it? Well, it can be done, and uh, oh, it's it's amazing to see it be done. You know, uh, you, yeah, I don't know what to say about it. Yeah, it, it, it's, it's, you're it not is, the first one with is, that yeah, one. To be fair, it, it, there's no ways. I mean, I bet he's I bet he's sitting at home now with that fact check, thinking. Oh, I'll it, leave darts on the back. He didn't really know what to say himself. Did yeah, it? So, it, yeah. <laughs> what do you say? <laughs> So obviously, I mean, you're coming into this as well. Have you dared to dream what it'd be like to lift that trophy at Lakeside? I thought about it. Uh, it'd be nice, you know. It'd be nice. It'd be a bit more than nice, Scott. I don't know. Like I say, I never think that. You'd probably too stunned to say anything, wouldn't you? Yeah, I'd, I'd just well, just plonk the trophy down, <laughs> have a cup of tea. <laughs> <laughs> no, a cup of tea. A cup of tea. Huh? Of tea. <laughs> but obviously, you know, do you, you, you just play with that freedom to sort of. Do what you know, just make the best of it, really. Yeah, that, that's that's how I always am. I'll go into opens and classics and, and all the rest of the circuit and just take each one as it comes. If I win them, I win them. You mm. know, I'm pretty laid back to be fair. I don't knock myself when I lose because I don't expect to win everything. I don't think anyone can expect to win everything. Um, but yeah, if you win them, you win them. If you don't, just don't be hard on yourself, just carry on. Look at the next week, you know. Of course, You've got of course. a calendar full of dates there. <laughs> there is, there is. There's plenty of it. There's plenty of it. Well, Scott, fantastic to talk to you. Um, good to see you down here practicing and so on. Next time we'll see you, we'll be on that lakeside stage. Thanks very much for talking to us. We'll see you again next time. Thank you.